This thing just paused on me, and I don't know when it did. So stop recording? <laughs> no, it just... Hi. This is the blooper reel. <laughs> yeah, this is the blooper reel. We can, uh... After some technical difficulties, me accidentally putting, pushing something on here where I can't hear anything or have it go on. Um, so we'll do this again. What's up, ladies and gentlemen, you beautiful nerds? It's your boy, True, from Nerds New Sexy Entertainment. With me, I have Ly Ren, and I also have Jack Frost. So, Ly Ren, this costume took a while, right? Uh, yes, it did. It took, like, two and a half months, actually, yeah. Two and a half um, months, and that's sewing yeah. everything and everything like that, right? Everything, yeah, getting everything connected. I just did these, connected these, like, two nights ago. <laughs> oh, okay, so last-minute stuff? Yeah, cool. last-minute stuff. Which I do a lot. Um, it's made out of foam, a craft foam, and cardboard, duct tape, and uh, hot glue. That's okay. it. Because <laughs> this is all made out of PVC and it gets pretty heavy. Yeah, I try to make my uh, as light as I can, so okay. I can do more with them. But like at the same time, I'm trying to make them less delicate. So that of good course. in between. Of course. And now we have Jack Frost, and you said that this weapon was shipped to you, right? yes. or about not weapon, prop was shipped to you. Yes, because as I said, before I did not know how to make much of anything, and when I saw a friend of mine making his own Jack Staff, I was like, you know what? He basically took PVC pipe and wrapped in twine all around. So I was like, you know what? I might try that. Okay. Since this was just a late Christmas present. <laughs> <laughs> cool. The pants I did make myself, though. Can't really see it because I'm a brace. I put paint on them, and then I painted the little straps he has. Okay, cool. I originally used fabric strips, but they kept falling off, so I was like, you know what? I'm not going to deal with this anymore. I'm just going <laughs> to paint it on there. Of course, of course. You know, that's the hardships of cosplaying. Um, so, Rise of the Guardians is a pretty important movie to you, right? Yes. Okay. It, if I'm ever, like, sad or down, it helps me. Okay. Because it has good comedy in it, and it usually makes you laugh, makes you feel good. Okay, cool, cool. So, um, we'll, go, we'll go over here to Lai Ren. Um, so who is your favorite Ruby character, though? My favorite Ruby character? Oh. <laughs> I really love Ruby, and she helped me through a lot. Uh, I love Ren because I relate to him a lot. Okay. Because uh, <laughs> so would you those... say you're very, very quiet and introverted, and yeah, you can uh, disappear? Norm yeah, normally. <laughs> Not disappear. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm normally I'm very quiet and introverted. Uh, okay, that's so why I like cosplay. It because really it allows you to get out. out there. Yeah, it gets me out of, there, uh, out of my little hole. <laughs> okay, <laughs> like, great, great, uh, great. Let um, me express my creativity. So, what is your favorite uh, moment from Ruby? Uh, my favorite moment from Ruby, I think it was whenever uh, the main four met back up in like the newest. Season, oh, okay, like, okay, yeah, where they all got second. reunited. That scene was so important to me, and I love it so much. <laughs> Hold it very close to my heart. Okay, um, great. So yeah, it reminded me of like me being able to get friends because for the longest time I've had like the problem of not being able to con like, converse with people well and like not being able to have friends so like you know I would never have guessed that just because of how great you are great you're doing right now <laughs> thank you <laughs> and then uh what's your favorite moment from Rise of the Guardians um as of right now it's where Pitch and Jack confront in Antarctica and Pitch snaps Jack's staff and leaves him in the ravine Man, that's a dark moment to have as a favorite, but hey, you know, more power to you. <laughs> Usually dark moments in movies are my favorite. That's why I like horror movies so much. <laughs> okay, well, you would get along with some of the other nerds. I hate horror, so but I'm a big wimp, so maybe that's why. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, uh, what tips would you offer to anyone getting into cosplay? Um, probably don't, don't really ignore, um, the, ignore what everybody else says. Like, usually just cosplay wherever you want, no matter... Your size, your skin color, whatever. If you want to cosplay a character, go on, do it. Okay. It might make you feel better, and it will get you out of the house and be I'm able deaf. to. I mean, that makes <laughs> <sense>. <laughs> and uh, make new friends. I've met so many new friends doing these perfect, conventions. Perfect. Perfect. And uh, what about you? Any other um, tips you can offer? Just be you. Like, don't like try to change yourself whenever you cosplay. Like, yeah, you can listen to. Constructive criticism, okay. which is actually a really important thing. Don't completely shut out like everything that everyone says. Try to listen to some people. Like so, whenever they're trying to give you cr uh, constructive criticism, don't completely attack them because you're like, "Well, I'm offended." <laughs> <laughs> okay, perfect. I have that big problem of whenever someone can, like they criticize me, I'm like, yeah. "Oh, I'm gonna like shut them out" because like <laughs> it's kind of a bad habit of mine. I'm like, you know. Maybe I should take some of that constructive criticism. So Pretty much avoid the trolls. Yeah. 
Great. That, that's, that's honestly one of the best things that I think I can think of to offer to that, too. Um, so you guys said you both have Instagrams. What's yours? Uh, Coda underscore cosplay. Okay, and that's with a K? Yes. Okay, Coda underscore cosplay and? Uh, Roof Snowfall with like three L's. Yeah, three L's. Oh, man. Okay, so Ro what is it? Ro Rose Snowfall. Okay, Rose Snowfall uh, with three with L's. With three L's. Is it underscore or anything like that? No, no okay. underscore. So we will go ahead and uh, link that in the bottom. You guys can check that out. And um, as always, stay nerdy.